Well, now to some new concerns for all the new electric buses for Indigo's massive Redline project. Those new electric buses from bus manufacturer BYD, which stands for Beyond Your Dreams, are supposed to have a range of 275 miles on a single charge. But that range seems to be just a dream after Call 6 uncovered those buses have only been averaging about 205 miles during testing. Yeah, Call 6 investigates Paris Lubell joining us live this morning uncovering that the testing could be flawed. Paris, good morning. Lauren and Meredith, good morning. Each one of those buses cost $1.3 million, and they're back out on the streets today for testing. But on the bus this week, there's hundreds of these sandbags on board. At a price tag of $1.3 million each, those electric buses to run the red line keep running into issues. 13 buses are on order for the red line. They're supposed to have a range of 275 miles on a single charge. But after Call 6 obtained internal Indigo testing documents from sources, those buses are only averaging 205 miles. But now sources tell Call 6 that testing was flawed and the range will be even less. It's because those tests by Indigo were done without simulating any passengers on board, just the bus driver and a few staff members. They didn't factor in the thousands and thousands of extra pounds added to the bus when passengers start riding it. Bus experts we talked to say the range will drop dramatically when weight is added because the motors have to work harder. The bus being used by the red line is the same model that was plagued with range issues in other places around the country, like in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Frankly, dealing with that company and those buses have been uh, a challenge challenge, a huge challenge. In November last year, our ABC sister station KOAT in Albuquerque was above the buses as the city returned them to BYD because they weren't getting the 275 miles per charge as promised. Sky 7 was above the buses as they moved out of town on I-40, but the fleet didn't make it far. One bus only made it 100 miles before it had to pull over. Back in Indianapolis, Indigo tells us they're continuing to test the buses, and in a short statement, they say at this time, we are still working with BYD on a remedy for the range issues. Now on Monday, it was the first time Indigo filled one of the buses with sandbags to simulate that weight. We asked for the results of that testing. We're still waiting for that today. We're live this morning. Paris LaBelle, RTV6.